Hi, I'm Peter Pelican, and this is a portrayal of our camp at Murfreesboro, Tennessee, of the 36th Illinois. I myself, I'm getting shaved by my good part, Ezra Parker. We have Judd Turton over here to our left. The 36th Illinois fought in the Battle of Murfreesboro under General Sheridan's division. We sustained a tremendous amount of casualties. 300. 300 to be exact, but we successfully defended the Union left against General Claiborne's uh, brigade, the division at that point, excuse me. Our camp set up, we've got our winter quarters, and inside of our, each man has his equipment, personal items, small camp stoves, we've got different coffee pots, canteens, we have a weapon stack to our left over here. The 36th Illinois started off organized in Aurora, Illinois in 1861. There was a total of 1,000 men when they first went off the war. They also had two cavalry companies that was pretty unique. They were actually supposed to be an Illinois Legion, but they never received a battery of guns that would have been the full complement. The 36th Illinois is credited with killing General Mc, uh, Mc, McCulloch and McIntosh at the Battle of Pea Ridge in 1862. General, uh, let's see, we then moved to to stop uh, General Bragg's uh, Kentucky invasion in 62. We fought at the Battle of Perryville. We were, after that, we were at Murfreesboro now. We will later fight at Chickamauga and help hold back the Confederate armies as the Union Army retreats from that battle. We were also part of Opdyke's Tigers when they stopped the breach at Franklin in 1864. This 36th Illinois also fought during the Atlanta campaign at Rosaka, Georgia, Kennesaw Mountain, Tunnel Hill. Let's see. Chattanooga, Nashville, Franklin. Yep. We're also credited with being the first on top of uh, Chatt uh, at, uh, Missionary, Ridge. Missionary Ridge at the Battle of Chattanooga. Our flag was the first one at the very top, although the 24th Wisconsin's credited because they're the first officer to be at the top. Actually, the 36th Illinois and the 24th Wisconsin had a long history. When the 24th Wisconsin arrived at, in Lexington, Kentucky, in 1862, they were ashamed to see themselves next to the 36th Illinois, who was just coming back from Pea Ridge. The men were all in tatters and their uniforms were desolate. But the 24th Wisconsin, very good. The 24th Wisconsin, they were blamed once for stealing a the sheep of a local farmer, which 36 Illinois had taken their knapsacks and worn them, which falsely identified the 36.